beautiful birdhouse we saved. Look at this, friends. We saved it. I love it. I bet you they've been using it. I did that for you, honey. How are we doing, friends? How's everybody doing? Well, she had to go. What's it like? Have you guys got, uh, have you got any view? Oh yeah, good. Good, good. Hi friends, good to see ya. Just getting a little bit of a, a chore. I've been waiting for the rain and the bad weather so that I could have a big blazing fire and not have to worry about it, you know what I mean? Just hit it. So we got a bit of wood to play around with, get in the shed for next season or the season after. It's good to see everybody. I, uh, yeah, I, I got a sweat on. Big time sweat. <clears throat> I'll just put this uh, here. <clears throat> anyway, I'll show you what, what we did here. You guys remember this tree, right? Remember this one, friends? Yeah. Something here. Something. I need something that I have to do. I'll just show you. So 
So this tree was starting to eat our house. Okay. It was starting to eat our freaking house. And I'll show you what I'm talking about. Look. You can, you can see it. So it was right there, Hogan's room. But what I done here, friends, is I did a back cut first. I got it all on film for you. I got a nice little video for you guys. There's the doghouse that nobody saw because it was underneath there. But it, it was actually very interesting. But I'm gonna explain when I do the, when I show you guys the video, why I did back cut first and why it's important when you, when you've got a horrible lean behind you, not to, not to screw up on your cuts at all. One little screw up and you're in problems. I didn't hang a rope. I took a good look at it and I thought I'm gonna bang it. So I banged it. I bung it. I bung the sucker. Okay, that's that. So, starting to rain. So there was the tree. It came right to the fire pit actually, friends. Hey? Yeah, it came right to the fire pit. I hope you're all doing well tonight. I just, uh, I didn't get a video up today, friends. So I thought, you know what? I'm freaking going live. Yeah, I am. Yeah, yeah, I said, forget it. So. Yeah, I'm just getting Tin Man Saw kind of tuned in to this, that muffler, that um, Wild West Garage. Go see Morgan. Hey friends, we got 284 people and we've got 137 thumbs up. That's, uh, that's disgraceful, friends. Come on, that's, that's freaking disgraceful in this community. Let's go, let's get it up. <laughs> Come on, friends. There you go, that's a little better. Buck 50, we got a buck 50. Oh, buck 63, thank you, thank you. Good, good. We gotta get us up to a couple hundred and fifty or something, 250, there's gotta be a 250 out there somewhere. Who says 250, where's the 250? Come on, break it down, 250, sold 250. Oh, my goodness. Anyway, we're not gonna be long, but uh, it's getting dark as you can see. I just thought I would flip her on live tonight for a few minutes, friends. You know, 20, 25 minutes, half an hour. Say hi to everybody. I'm just out having a sweat. There's my wife. Oh, there's Chica. There's Chica. Hi, Chica. 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 Chica, Chica, Chica. She ain't coming. The fire or the tree? Okay. Myrtle. Uh, does Hogan, he, did he send him a picture? Not yet. I sent him a video. I hope it went. Oh, yeah? So Ho Hogan doesn't know it's done yet. Oh, whoa. So, super tankers. Super tankers. Rob Zuko. Hey, thanks for the super chat, buddy. Or super sticker, whatever that was, you crazy guy. Thank you. Appreciate you. Hey, we're up over 200 now, friends, on the, on the, on the freaking thumbs up. That's good to see. YouTube likes that. They like to see an engaging community being a YouTuber now and all that, you know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. Whoa, 310 people, holy smackers, what happened here? Well, you, you just pulled into the live, you better hit the freaking thumbs up, friends, come on now. <laughs> I'm gonna tend to that fire, friends, for a minute. Wow, that's gonna change it up. Isn't that nice, babe? It's a shock though, isn't it? I know, but you know what we can do, don't you? We can landscape this. I know. Do you want this camera open? Yep. You wanted it wide open? Yeah, I did, yeah. I had a camera in there. Oh. All right. Chica. <laughs> Old tripod Chica. 
That's our three-legged dog, friends. She's very elusive. Isn't that a nice little, did, yeah, that's beautiful. We saved the birdhouse. I got to just stoke this thing a bit, friends. I'll get you guys to settle down in here in a minute, for a minute. 246 thumbs. Good to see. Nice to see some super, super chatters there and super thanksers. Appreciate you guys. Appreciate you a lot. Thank you. Grab this middle yeah, thing. Oh. I'm good. How are you? Say hi to everybody. Rita. Sup, guys? Like here is probably good, Dad. Yeah. Thank you. How are you? Haven't seen you in a couple of days. Yeah. I just, yeah I just gotta get this straight. Are you uh, sticking around? I just kind of came to say hi. Okay. Very cool. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> My partner, my partner Rita. Hi guys. <laughs> okay, I'll turn this on and I'll come to you. Okay. Before I ran out of gas, I think. Uh oh. Okay, talk to them for a sec, Bob? Sure. <laughs> okay, you're on the other side. Ryan. Hello everyone. Got a pretty wicked fire going here. <laughs> I want to be able to see what you guys are saying. Kevin Duff, that is Rita. Hi, Kevin. <laughs> oh my goodness. Is she going? <laughs> yeah, she's going. We might not need this bomb. Yeah, I don't think you do. How are you? Good. Good to see you. You look sweet. Thanks. It might do it on its own bomb. Let's see. Oh. 
Hello from Arkansas. When are you fixing the target that you broke? <laughs> yeah, that's right. I don't know. You got to fix that target, honey. I know. Oh, there you go. Look at that. I was wondering how to do that. Look at this sweet, sweet girl. Hello. <laughs> how are you, Mom? I'm doing good. I'm, I'm doing good. It's so good to see you. You too. Look at that freaking fire. Dude. Hi, Rob. Oh, what a great family. That's not going to burn that thing, Dad? No, it'll be good. I burnt it before. It just, yeah. So I kept, look at how bald that side of the house is. I know. What have you been doing? Well, I took that tree down, honey. Oh, it's blowing I know, bum. I know. It was killing the. It was killing the house, hon. Yeah. So, friends, you might all of a sudden just disappear. The battery might just die. I don't know. Look at how bright that is! Let You know what? We've had enough rain. It's time. Yeah. Time. I knew when I pulled in you were doing something. I know. You snuck up well, on me, you kid. Also see the picture I sent you? No, I, I, I've been driving, so let me check right now. Oh. <laughs> Jeez. You know what? A crazy shock, eh? The creek comes dark. I was driving home. I'm like, okay, four? Okay. I noticed that yesterday or the day before. Okay. Okay, friends. Well, I know it's dark. Hang on a sec.
It'll be part two to this too, friends, I reckon. Right? Hey, we got, uh, we got a super chatter here. We got to say something to this fella. His name's All Things Jonesy, or All Things Johnny. Bye, Bob. Love you. Okay, say goodbye, Rita. Bye. Bye, hon. Oh, okay, I'll be in shortly. It's getting dark. I just want to prep this up and I'll be in a bit. I do. Thank you. Love you. Is it heavy, babe? We got a parcel, friends. Should we do it on the live feed? Should we see if we got enough jam? We got 310 freaking thumbs up. We got $78 in super chatters on a freaking whatever night it is. And we got 377 people. We should almost have a look inside that freaking... Uh, Maybe I'll go get it. You guys want to crack into a box? I think I know what's in there. But you guys are going to run out of jam. I do know that. So let me plug you in. But it is getting dark over here. But you know what we could do? We could do this. I could plug you guys in. And we could, uh, I know exactly what we could do. And I say we do it. Why not? Let's go. Let's actually, uh... who's that? Yeah. Oh yeah, let's go. I got the parcel, see? Let's go. I'll get you guys plugged into the bunker. We'll go hang out in the bunker for a little bit. Friends, I just thought, you know what? I'm, I'm a prideful guy and uh, I, know it's, I know it's actually, it's silly to try and think that I can get a video out every day. I, I know that's almost, kind of weird but I try what the heck's all that oh weird look at these okay listen you you guys are are uh who is this I don't know you guys are going to be one of the first to hear about this there's something going on I'm going to tell you what it is just a minute okay I'm going to tell you what's going on I'm on a journey and Nick's, Nick's boots, Nick's boots is, is willing to work with me on it. Friends, I, I want to explain something to people here. This is going to be fun. We're settled in. We're plugged in. It's looking good. Let's get up a bit here. Look at this. Whoa. Sorry, friends. Okay. Here we go. Okay. You guys, do you guys want to, you guys want to know something? Do you want to know how difficult it was for me when, when the boots came from that other company with a, a stitch down construction. Friends, I'm from Vancouver Island, British Columbia. Um, Viberg, Dayton, Paris, 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 Paris boots, a couple other companies, but there was three or four, you know what I mean? But they weren't stitch out. So as you all know, I, I lived in Viberg for, for 25 years. I still have Viberg, but I was in a bad way when, the, when a boot company reached out to me a while back. And uh, when I cracked them out of the box, I was like, oh yeah, these are deadly. Remember friends? It's all on the channel. But then I put them on my feet and I was like, I looked down and I was like, oh no, I, 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 can't, I can't do this. I, I cannot live like this. Friends, I'm, I'm, I'm on a mission right now. I'm, I'm telling you, I'm on a mission. I want to understand why. This is an old pair of boots. Why they switched from nail, nail construction to stitch out. Yeah, I get it. The water is, goes up, but no, I, that's not my experience, friends. I, I'm just telling you, it's not my experience. I've been logging for... A long time fallen, walking through creeks, standing in mud puddles. Friends, <laughs> I've had dry feet in these boots. Not these particular ones, but this design. 
So, but anyways, regardless, I'm kind of going off. I want to understand why they switched and why companies are still making the nail down. There's only a couple, but they're still making them. They're what I like. Do you guys know what I'm talking about? The profile of the boot, where they fold the leather under, kind of like a Blake stitch. Okay? Look it. This is what I'm talking about. Nail down construction. No stitch out. Where they, where they fold it out and stitch down. This is nail down construction. These are what I like. You see? I got a pair here. Okay? They're beat up. They're thrashed. I'm going on a mission. I'm going to go get, I'm going to go talk to some old cobblers. So this is the difference, friends. This is what I'm talking about. I think you guys know what I'm talking about. I'm talking about that right there. Right? The stitch out. Okay? There's nothing wrong with it. It's, I know it's easier and faster to make and it takes less material. I guaranteed it does. But friends, uh, Nyx has been phenomenal with me working with my quirky little ways. Those aren't even their Kelties. They're mine, like a, like a Viberg style. But they've worked with me to get this as narrow as possible for me. So this is a nail down construction. It goes under. Okay? So I'm on a, I'm on a quest. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go talk to some old cobblers and I'm gonna find out why. Why did they switch? Was it simply because it was easier to make? Well, I think there's probably gonna be some of that. Yeah, the water and that, uh, they say, that's what they say. Well, they're not about to say, well, we stopped making that boot because it's easier to make the, the stitch out, uh, stitch out boot. It's easier to make that. And uh, even though, you know, there's no, there's no literature anywhere saying that there's something wrong with this. There's none. They say that the mud and the water go. Okay, whatever. Not my experience. If you put, if you get it done right, if you stick your beat. I'm just, I can only speak from my own experience. Now, I don't even know what's in here. But I got a feeling. Okay, I need to shout somebody out here right now. This stuff's deadly. My glasses must have... Where are the suckers? They must be out on the grass somewhere. Oh no, I think I put them down. Anyway. I wish you could smell this. Oh, it's beautiful. I'm just going to get some moisture into these babies. You know, it's, you know what it's like with dry hands and cardboard, friends? You know what I'm talking about? It's a terrible feeling. Your whole body goes, ah, ah. right? Cardboard? Ah. What's going on here? I don't even know what this is. It might not be what, uh oh, oh dear. Friends, no one has seen this yet. This is live right now. This is crazy. This is why I love life so much. I do. I love it. Just show up for life. Just go. Just get up and go and show up and just open your hands to the world and spread your belly to the sky to the big fella and just go, here I am. What are we doing today? Come with me. Get on my shoulder. Bring me love. And let me just go and show up. Check this out. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh my. <laughs> Bradley. Bradley, old boy. Oh, heavens to Betsy. So Brad and I are working on a couple things. And 
here it is. Oh, Bradley! Oh! Wow. Okay, now, we got a problem on our... Oh, my goodness gracious. Just hang on. Just you freaking hang on a second here right now. <laughs> Wait, is that? Where's that freaking thing? Is it there? No. Oh, what's this? Yeah, it is. Where does that go? Oh, it goes right there. Does this work? I guess not. Oh, okay. Well, maybe, maybe we can do this. Maybe we'll get very lucky. I think we might. Am I blocking you guys out? Let's see. Maybe I can do this. Maybe, maybe I'm actually cool. Just cool enough. I might just be cool enough to do this, friends. I might not be, but I'm going to try. What's this mean? That means that. Oh, look, would you look at this? Hi. Hi, Bill. Hi, Bill Smith. Live. Buck and Billy Ray. Live. 441 people on a freaking Tuesday night. Oh, I see that light right there on the side. He is there. Let's see if we can get rid of that sucker. Is that going to work? Uh, I can see it there. Oh, maybe that's going to disappear because, it, yeah, it is. Okay. Super chatters. Thank you. Let's turn this down now. You want to check something out? This is crazy. Bradley, I don't know if you're watching or not. Brad, are you here? Broad River Forge, buddy, are, are you here? Not everybody wants a five and a half pound walloper, right? Wow. Wow. Me and Brad are working on something else, friends. See this? This is off a design of an axe that Don Snow gave me. Don Snow, I don't know if he's here or not, but it's off of, it's off of this design right here. This is from the late 1800s. Stolber. J.B. Stolber or Stoller. You know the one? Look what Brad did. Look what he did. This is, uh, this is very interesting. I'm going to try something though, friends. Just bear with me. I need you to I need you to hang tough. You know what? I'm gonna try something. Just don't don't get too excited on me. I think I did better. I think I did. Whoa, Johnny McCormick with a super chat. Five and a half pound nice. Yeah, it is nice. That right there is about three three and a half pounds. That's what that is. I can feel it. It's just over three and a half pounds. What an incredible little tool. What an incredible, incredible little tool. Uh, I'm going to half this. I talked to Jonesy. He's working on a, we're working on an ax, friends, a different ax. The, the wood bullet, uh, I have found from about four different guys now that apparently it's difficult. It's difficult. It's still going to happen. It's still going to happen, but that's why it's taken so long. Um, Brad, I, I'm, I'm pretty tickled. I got to turn that blower off.
Sorry, friends. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, Bradley. Wow. Brad, are, is, friends, have you seen Brad? Oh, oh. oh no, that's that's better there, Brad. That's 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 what I'm talking about right there. Bradley, are these easier for you to make? Holy smackers, buddy. Oh my. Three and a half, three and a half, four pounds, friends, is, I mean, I, I you know what I like, the, I, what I've noticed with working with blacksmiths is it's very difficult for people to repeat the same acts. That's where that Leon Hoffman has does, he's done a good job, let's be honest. He has done an amazing job. Um, we've got one more company, Brad's still working with me doing some things, absolutely. Well, we have another fella trying, and I'm excited, but I've learned now to not get too excited. Now, what's he got here? Oh, yay. Oh, yay. Oh, my. Oh, this one's lovely. Okay. Bradley. I think that's some of your finest work right there, Brad. You see here, friends? Oh, wow. Look at what he did. Oh, I like that. Oh, I like this. These are just things he was playing around with, friends. Look at what he did here. Look at that. That's my new axe. That's five and a half pounds. <laughs> I can't get over these, Bradley. Buddy. Four hundred and forty people. Nice to see everybody. This one's lighter. Five pounds. That one's five. Dead square. That was that, that. nice, nice, Brad. Oh, look at this. Okay, this makes me happy, Brad. This makes me very happy. I'm starting to look at this a little differently. Anyways, I'm gonna go. I wanna go see Rita and my wife and hang out. I got that tree down. I got a video coming for you tomorrow. Uh, I'm going on a search. I'm, go I'm going back. I'm going way back to history. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to understand why. Why? And you know what? Nix, Nix is going to work with me on something. They've been very gracious, friends. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to find out from old, old cobblers 
why why this went this way. My inclination is that it took more leather to make the nail down. Obviously it does. You got to roll it under and do something with it. Perhaps more nails for sure. Harder on the hands, really hard on the cobbler. And they found a different way to make a boot. There's pros and cons to both friends. Don't think there is not. And when you're an old school guy like me who, who feels like he was born a hundred years too late, I, I, I just, I struggle with some things and I really struggled with that stitch out, friends. I'm just being honest, I did. But Nix, Nix was able to work with me pretty much the same profile as my old Vibergs. Just saying, great company. I'm very happy with these folks. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna go. This was on a whim. Friends, work hard. Be honest. All I got right here for the last few minutes is this little thing here. I haven't answered any comments. If you super chatted tonight, I love you. Thank you all so much. Friends, that was a fun one. I'll catch you on the next one. We'll catch you a video for tomorrow. And we'll take off through the week. We'll start slapping out some more content for you. I just didn't want to miss today. I don't know why. I just did over and out.